crickets are back. Ah, he, the pathway was all blocked too. Hmm. I guess we're just gonna leave that grindstone here for now. <laughs> Some kind of settlement. Finally, I will meet the locals. Pumpkin tin. What kind of name is that? I want to live there, actually. I like pumpkins. Pumpkin spice, pumpkin pie, jack-o'-lanterns, you know, all the pumpkin stuff. Oh, it looks like this ladder has seen better days. Whoa! Wind energy. Pumpkinton's gates are opened by energy, which is created by the incredibly fast rotation of windmills. On weather vanes. You're not happy with the Comic Sans font? <laughs> Did you shiver from the puzzle? <laughs> not gonna lie. It does worry me. It does worry me a wee bit. Oof. To open the lock on the gate, I need to apply energy from the weather vanes to the lock. Oh, there's a dog here too. And a cow? Queasel BB, how are you doing? Never too late. Never. Uh, we did not get the morphing object by the tree. Is that on an earlier uh, scene, uh, Tildy? Let me see here. Oh! Here? I think... Is this what you mean, uh, Tildy? Where is it? Oh my god, I didn't mean to zoom in like that. Cat Buzz! Happy, happy day. How are you doing? I hope I don't have any crashes today. We're doing Lost Lands first, and then we'll switch over to Mr. Case Files. Uh... So I'm looking for the morphing object, which is like a piece of wheat. Man, these crickets are like fierce, rubbing their legs together. Oh, there. Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. Got it. Yeah, no crashes today. Let's all hope for no crashes today. So put the vein on the left. Got it. Uh, okay, not quite ready for that, I don't think. Uh, oh, boy. First, I need the energy. Interesting. It won't let me put that up there. That is a weather vane, is it not? You're used to crickets, they're always coming on your property. Crickets. Uh, stained glass piece. Hmm, this looks gorgeous back here, actually. Look at that nice sunshine. And the clouds. Yeah, we'll, we'll pray for and you know what was weird about Mr. Case Files? It was crashing not when I pick up stuff, because that's usually what happens in every Hopa game I've ever played. It was crashing on cutscenes. I've never had that happen before. Crashing on a cutscene is insane to me. <laughs> it's just playing a video. How the hell is it crashing? Uh, okay, what am I doing here? Because I, I lost my... Oh, apparently I need to deal with this. Oh, no, yeah, I agree. Lost Lands is a great series. We're Right now, we're playing the grandchild, actually. She got slurped up in this world here. So what am I doing? Roots cover the stairs. I need to remove them with a sharp knife? Okay, usually that would be for an axe, but... Oh, okay, now we can weather vein it up. Got it. Ooh. First, we need this. Then we need that. Can't we just hop the fence now? <laughs> like, I feel like we're already up there. Just hop the fence. Then we could skip this redonkulousness over here. Yes, the heroine, she had gray hair. She's a grandmother. Which I think is awesome. Okay, I guess we're putting that over here. I think. Here we go. Whew, find your zen place. I, I could, it's like a triple whammy here. We got to get these lined up first. First, I need to create the energy. Oh, so maybe we got to do this thing first. 
Okay. All right. Deep breath, deep breaths. Whew. All right, stepping in. Let's do this. What are we doing? To open the lock on the gate, I need to apply energy from the weather veins to the lock. I thought that's what I was trying to do. I think... Oh, I need the whirly gig. It worked. Now do I do the one here? Oh boy. Uh, yikes. Good Lord. Okay, that one's done. Uh, and that one's done. Deep breaths. Oh, let's see what we have here. Click on the stone to turn them. Create an unbreakable closed chain by directing the rays to the center. Hmm. So do I just rotate them? Yeah, I think so. I'm assuming we have to fill it all up, right? Maybe? I don't know. Hmm. I'm guessing we have to fill it all up. This doesn't look right, though. Oh my god, the animals. You need to settle down there, buddy. <laughs> I got roosters too. Remember the rooster earlier in the game? Good lord. That was a noisy rooster. Um, I think this is it. Well, that, you know, in case of emergency, <laughs> that's how you get into our town. Yikes. You must find us. Swim to us. I'm sorry I scared you. I thought you felt bad. Uh, no, not at all. I had a vision. For the second time. Vision? And what did you see? A waterman. He called me for help. We were told at school about some aquatic creatures. They are called Capitons. Ah, see? They live on only one floating island far from here. Yes, yes! The floating island was also in my vision. And there was also a river. I have to get to this river. River? We have many different rivers here. I don't know which one you need. Hmm. If only I could show you my vision somehow. We can go to my house. <coughs> I have paper and charcoal there. By the way, I'm Joko. Welcome to Pumpkinton, the halfling village. I am Kiana. It's good to meet you. Yay! Now, there is no one at home. Parents are at work in the fields like almost all villagers. We can look for your river. <laughs> Sage, welcome on in. You came from touching grass to watch videos. Good for you. Uh, this is quite the interesting little dynamic we've got in front of us. Uh, I don't know if we trust this child, this young gentleman here, but um, I don't think Kiana has much choice but to... Go in with her eyes wide open, you know? She certainly shouldn't go in with her eyes wide shut. Man, this music is, is quite nice. That's a lot of fish. Dry fish. Hmm. I want some. I brought grain. 
My cart broke down on the way, and one kind woman helped me fix it. Oh, remember that? From the main game? Grandma did that. All right, rooster. <laughs> Where the hell are you? Okay, I guess we're going this way. Dear Jocko, your dad. Do you know oh. about the place from the note? Certainly. It's there, behind the stained glass window. Well, you know, having several wives does make farming a hell of a lot easier. You know, like three or four, I think is probably a good number. And then each of them has like three or four kids. Good lord. Farming. That's how you farm. The door is locked. Ooh, look at all these pumpkins. The sister wives. Isn't that what that is? Uh, ooh, got something. Part of the pattern. Stained glass piece. Pumpkinton has pumpkins, so that's that's at least assuring. Jaco's Jocko's family chops wood. I don't have an axe though. <laughs> Reactions. Oh. You need to assemble the stained glass window to open it. What? One, two, three. Well. I see that ten elements are missing. By the way, here, I found one lost piece. So we need ten of them. That's kind of neat how it turned from uh, just three to now four to ten. That is kind of cool. From a game mechanic perspective. Those are some pretty flowers. I think there's going to be bumblebees here, maybe. Ooh, what wonderful flowers. Cut them with my knife. No. Okay, where is this rooster? We need to go and say hello. So we are missing the morphing object there. Let's go back to town. So part of a pattern. Hmm. Is that a horse? I kind of... Looks like a dog, doesn't it? Oh no, I guess it's got a face of a horse. I hear a dog, though. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> the item is unlikely to be any use in this situation. Now we can see it a bit better. Those are some big sunflowers. Okay, we've got another stained glass piece. Six out of ten. So there was a morphing object here, apparently. Hmm. Oh, there it is. Is that a sheep? <laughs> They've got all of the animals. It's a zoo here. So seven out of ten. Hmm. The Hobbit Hole House. It kind of looks like that, doesn't it? Yeah. It, it's. I mean, it looks like it had originally a round door, and now it's been kind of co-opted here. Their farmer is dodgy. Uh, what's the farmer's son, right? I'm guessing. Unless he is really the farmer. And then that is kind of dodgy. Okay, there's got to be something here. Dry fish. Someone needs to quiet up the dogs here. Okay, we're getting real close. Nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. Okay, so it's got to be here somewhere. Whew. Okay. Okay, shush, shush. I'm looking for stained glass pieces. Sunflowers on here too. Hmm. Like, I do not see this. Bilbo was gone. They moved on. Yeah, exactly. Oh my god, it's right there. Wow. This was originally... What's Hobbit Town? This is now Pumpkin Town? <laughs> oh boy, oh boy. How does this work? Oh.
Does it matter how? Oh, it does matter a little bit. Do these all go here? Okay, someone needs to go play with the dog or something. I don't know if all these pieces fit. Just feels wrong. <laughs> um, no, it doesn't work there either. This is odd. This must go here. No, nope. this one. Hmm. Nope. This goes here? Nope. Is it me or do these pieces not fit? This is a very odd stained glass window. They fit? Really? Okay. That must go there. Just not very accurately, I guess. Oh, it even lets me move them after I've placed them. Oh, good heavens. Uh, that's got to go here. Okay. Shush, please. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah, so what's underneath it has nothing to do with this puzzle at all. That's what's throwing me off. There we go. Yeah, that's the click sound. That it was a click sound. Not even my click. You could probably hear my click because my mic's next to my keyboard. Okay, are we hopping through or who's what's going on here? Oh, it was just to get the key. What if we see Gandalf? Then we know we're really going to be in trouble. Welcome. The secretary should have everything we need. The secretary. Hmm. This hamster made passages inside the walls. He has a whole system of holes here. Hamster? Are hamsters considered rodents? One of the wives? Exactly. 